They just look so good. It's an honor to throw behind all staters um, that I've never had the privilege to. Uh, it's it'll be really fun. Tyler Steinkamp's excitement is certainly understandable. After winning just four football games over the last two seasons, the Mark Twain tailback is getting a chance to end his high school career on a high note, with much more assistance than he's ever received before. And consider, this is a guy who managed to rush for 1,500 yards and 16 touchdowns last season, despite the obstacles stacked against him. I think I have pretty good speed and vision, and I know when to cut back and uh, when to lower my shoulder. You're a guy who's not afraid of contact either. I mean, is that always kind of been your style? Um, not at the earlier years, but my junior and senior year, I started getting a little bit bigger, and I thought, what the heck, why not? I, I haven't missed a day of weightlifting in four years. It was a good career at Mark Twain, and hopefully I can end it with a win here. Some of these kids play for programs that didn't experience a whole lot of success, and when they get a chance to come out here and get a stage like this, like a Tyler Stein camp at Mark Twain, it's a really big opportunity for them, isn't it? It is a big opportunity for them. Uh, and it's a great opportunity for them because they get to play with the really successful kids from every other school. And you know, every one of these kids is a winner. They're the best players off their team. And probably my biggest job is trying to make sure that they know, hey, everybody's got a role here, and your role on this team is not going to be the same as it was when you were the biggest duck on the pond. And the West squad certainly doesn't lack for those kind of prize birds at running back, whether it's the unsung Tyler Steinkamp, who signed with Central Methodist, whether it's a converted quarterback in the person of Austin Egley from Clark County or a true power runner like Palmyra's Dylan Parrish. It's a very good group, uh, really impressive, a real good group of athletes, uh, very coachable, and they're like sponges. And they just pick stuff up fast. I don't really have any guys that I have to slow down for.